everybody, it's Elisa from Elisa's Art Room. I just wanted to take a second and show you how to use this Ladybug Vac. A lot of you watch me use this on my lives and when I got it, it didn't have clear instructions on how to do everything. So I figured I'd just take a second and kind of show, show you how it works. So first of all, um, you put the batteries in. They're inside, it takes two double A's. Okay, and there's this little spot right here. One says close and one says open. Okay, and then it just kind of fits on there sideways like that. See how there's a little gap? And then you turn it to lock it. Okay, so that's how the batteries are in there. And you turn it on right here on the side. And you just clean up your mess. My batteries are almost dead. <laughs> so... And I'm going to replace those in just a second. Um, then you want to open it to clean it out. Now, these little parts here, I usually just pull it off because the hair and stuff will get stuck on those little bristles. And that's fine. You can just pull it off, throw it in the trash. Um, so have yourself a trash can. Let me just use a plate because I don't have one right now. Um, so you're going to want to open it where it says open on the front here. And it says push and there's a little arrow going this way. So you just take your thumb and you just push it like that. Okay, and it's gonna come open. And then you can just dump out that side. Okay, and now this comes out. So it fits in here this way. So you can notice it has a smaller side here that's more narrow. That's the side that goes on the bottom and it just pulls straight out, all right? And you can just dump that side out. All right, and then what I use is just a little chip brush. Um, you could use a chip brush, a little hog hair brush, these are very inexpensive. Um, you can use it just for cleaning. These are also very inexpensive. And then I just, I hold the fan so it doesn't spin on me. So I just hold it. And I usually will just kind of brush it out and get all of the loose debris out of there. You can also use this in your little vents on the side. And just clean those out a little bit. Okay, so it's nice and clean. It doesn't have to be perfect. You're just gonna get it dirty again, but you know, keep it clean so it works properly. Do the same thing with all of your parts. Okay, I just clean them all out with my little brush. Clean this off. And then this has a little mesh thing here. And you'll notice that everything sticks to the mesh there. So you can just brush all that off. You just wanna make sure it's nice and clean. All right, and then of course you just dump your trash. I just usually do it over my trash can. And then you're gonna put it back together, okay? So this goes in first and you just, it goes, it's pretty obvious how it goes. I mean, it looks the same, but the small end goes on this side and you just fit it right in there, all right? It just kind of pushes into place, it's not hard. Now this part, you're gonna want to have it the same direction. It's also got the small end there. There's a little hook right here. Okay, see that little hook? That little hook goes here. There's a little notch. Okay, so that little hook goes there. So you put that side in first, and then you line that up, and you just push it closed. All right, now it's in, and it's ready to use again. Okay, and let me see if I have batteries, and I'll go ahead and show you that real quick. So get your double A's. Like I said, you just turn it um, counterclockwise, okay, and lift. And just pull your batteries out. And take note of the positive and the negative. It does say it on there. So make sure you put them in the right direction. All right, once you put it on there, just stick it back on the same way, make sure it's at an angle, and then turn it back. And you are ready to go. Okay, that's how you use it. So, y'all enjoy it, it's a nice little tool. Um, I'm not affiliated or nothing, I just thought I'd take a second and show you how to use it. But it is a nice little tool. So, y'all take care, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.